Kim Kardashian had a witty observation about the heights the famous family had risen to as season four of the Kardashians wound down. Guys, we scammed the system. We did it. Whatever it is, we figured it out and did it. We put in some hard work, Kim joked as part of her toast to Scott DeSick on his 40th birthday. Elsewhere, Kris Jenner also joked that that DeSick had been around since season one, episode one. Of course, the secret to the Kardashian success is not as mysterious as Kim makes it out to be. The young family was attached to two of the biggest faces of the 1980s and 90s, Robert Kardashian and Caitlyn Jenner. As the 90s became the 2000s, Kim firmly enshrined herself in the contemporary at girl culture, being seen alongside Paris Hilton at the height of Hilton's own fame. Then the WGA went on strike in 2007. And as networks scrambled to produce unscripted content with the writers on strike, there was Kim. Who better to focus a reality show around than the it-girl daughter of OJ's lawyer who recently just starred in a sex tape, one of the first viral videos of the new internet? The rest is history reality TV stuck around and once the foot is in the door, it's very easy to keep it there. Kim's main character status has really fallen off throughout this latest season of The Kardashians. While early episodes were dedicated to the fallout of her divorce from Kanye West, later episodes elevated Courtney's beef with Tristan Thompson to the show's a plot. However, that isn't to say that the season has been entirely Kimless. In an early November episode of the show, Kim gave a crucial update on her dating intentions. Across the episode, Kim reiterated her desire to remain single for at least two years, noting that she was about halfway through that goal after breaking up with Pete Davidson. I've got a year to go. I think that will be really good for me. I'm not looking, they seem to find me, but I'm not looking. Kim declared. Elsewhere, Kim also revealed a secret tattoo that she has kept hidden from everyone but her family. Kim pulled down her lower lip to reveal a small infinity symbol. According to Kim, she got the tattoo during an impromptu 4.30 a.m. inking session after hosting SNL for the first time. Furthermore, the tattoo goes against Kim's famous opposition to tattoos, at least for herself. You wouldn't put a bumper sticker on a Bentley, the scheme's founder once famously declared.